The forecast is the same. Today is a fairly nice day and the last for a little while. It's still beautiful out here in London. The clouds are building slowly. And in actual fact, you can see a line of them tracking up just east of the Pennines. These could develop into showers this afternoon. Also, there's a bit of fog just picking up off the northeast coast. It's drifting away now, thankfully. It's been there all morning. Southeast corner also is fairly cloudy, but the next arm of changeable weather is coming into this northwestern corner. So there's our lunchtime picture then. As I say, there'll be some showers this afternoon, possibly the same as yesterday. In other words, they'll turn sundry, but I think there'll be fewer of them. They're most likely to be in central or maybe eastern England. Most of the place is dry until, of course, later on in the day, already that it's raining in the Outer Hebrides, and that will drift onto mainland Scotland. Today's temperatures, though, are a reflection of the pleasant nearness of summer. 21 degrees in Birmingham, for example, although they will drop as that southwesterly picks up for Western Ireland and Western Scotland. That's what's bringing today's weather, but this is the low that will be in charge for the next four days or so. So it will sweep in many fronts, and it will bring in quite a lot of wind as well, and a certain amount of rain, the detail half determined at the moment. But it's for sure that it will be windy, and that will start, I think, with the rain later this evening. The wind will be mostly a westerly, a touch of south of it maybe, and a touch of north from time to time, bringing in just a little bit of winter to the tops of the mountains in Scotland late on Friday and during Saturday, maybe later on Sunday to, as well. Tonight, though, it starts to come in properly. This is the rain, the forecast rain, and that runs into northern Scotland, or even central Scotland, where that rain for a time will be heavy before it clears through. Of course, it'll stop a frost. So Friday starts with that rain band tailing off as it goes down through England, and once it's gone eastwards, it'll allow the showers to come in. And those will fairly quickly turn wintry for Scotland. Temperatures everywhere will be lower than today's, as you can see. On Saturday, it'll again be a little bit warmer in the south, but windy, but still fairly nasty 